Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Scott of RP. I'm here at Smig Stick Flowers. I got my bar band that it's getting fixed on the title's fully mine now, so yeah. Uh I'm gonna go pick it up. I'm finally back in town. I can't find Dickie anywhere though, but we're gonna try to see. Oh, what's that? My car's done? Oh my car's done? Uh, I can go get it. Alright, it's in the garage, alright. Yeah, I'm opening up a bar. I'm going to go buy some clothes next. I'm going to go to the clothes store. And I'm going to head back to my bar. Yeah, come down. It's 296 and Sandy, man. Yeah, I appreciate it. it wait, do you put fucking underglow under here, man? Why? Uh, you. Oh, I'm going to see. Oh, oh man. The, 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 when he gave this van to me, it was rusty, man. What would you do to it? What the fuck? It's got... Wait, what, what is this? It's a, the rear end is a Chevy. Wait, what? You literally took a Chevy body and a van body and you cut it and put. Uh, oh, okay. And what's this? Uh, what is this? Uh, rolling to. Oh. I don't. I don't really like the name. Uh, who was this? The guy's name for the company of the like the delivery and shit for the beers and all that. Well, I'm changing it to Little Dicks. Alright, thanks, man. I'm, I'm gonna go, go pick up the clothes and head to my bar. Close doors right up here. Yeah, let's go park on up and go get go get our uniforms. I'm gonna buy one for Dickie, even though I can't find him. Hopefully he's hopefully Marcus didn't kill him. They never told me if he was captured or not. It's fucked up. But maybe he thinks I'm dead if he's still alive. I mean, I almost died. Yeah, I'm here to pick up an order for uh, Mickey's Groovy Hangout. Yeah, it's a total of uh, three uh, yellow shirts, uh, three different pairs of jeans, and three different cowboy boots and cowboy hats. Alright, you got it? Uh, yeah, I'll pay for the bar stuff right here. Yeah, thanks. There you go. Alright, let's head back to the bar. Man, Dickie's gonna see me if I, if I ever find him, and he's gonna see this van. Like, what the fuck? Like, that's my van. I'm like, yeah, but some guy took like a Chevy rear end and fucking welded it on here, man. Cut, cut the body. It's fucking shame. That's a fucking classic. Ah, Sandy. Home, at least it was before I got kidnapped by the Epsilon program. I wonder if the train's gonna come back in town. There's been, like, trains delivering, pl like, military planes. It's been crazy. I haven't, I haven't seen a train since like the 70s and they're back in like action now. Yeah, let's turn right right here down the street from my bar. Whoops. Uh, I overshot that turn. Hopefully that cop didn't see it. I'm hearing sirens. Uh oh. 
ask you driving. I think you don't see which way you went. Oh shit. There's people here at my bar. Walking through the back. Uh, okay, let's check inventory. Uh, okay, yeah, we're still doing good in the piss washers. We're still doing good on. Let's see, let's. Let's go check the beers out. Yeah, we're doing good. We're doing good. Let's uh, check the cash register out, you know. Yeah, let's just start hitting these buttons and see how much money I made yesterday. Oh, shit. Man, I made 400 over yesterday. I made some good money. Fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Ah, fuck. Ricky didn't clean the fucking pizza trays from last night. Fucking asshole. Ricky didn't clean the fucking pizza trays last night. Fucking asshole. Hey, what's going on, man? Hey, man, I need me a beer. How's it going? Alright. What are you looking for, man? Wait a minute. Uh, piss bus. Uh, Dicky. Dicky. No, no, no. Let me come back there and give you a hug, you, man. You, you give me a hug, man. Oh, shit. Dicky. Uh, that's not letting me. I'm hitting Y. Oh, I, that's why. There we go. Oh, what's man, going on, man? It's good to see you. I'm so uh, glad. I, I, I know those Epsilon guys. They kidnapped me, man. Yeah, what happened? I don't know. I, I I made it to L.A. because I had the warrant up for my arrest, and I got to L.A. and I was on. I apparently I went on the wrong boat, and I went on the Epsilon boat, and I I had to kill some people. I didn't want to do that, but they were trying. Yeah, I, I I heard I heard all about it. And then I'm sorry, man. They 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 really wanted me to snitch on you. Oh, and then they oh gave yeah. Evidence of all that. I I found out towards the end that you had to do that because Chris told me, and then I I decided to realize it's all BS. Sperm is real. Storks don't deliver yeah. babies. And yeah, I know, man. And then all the other bullshit that he spewed at me. So then I sat there. I'm like, and you want to know something? I was like, I don't even think that you guys are going to kill Dickie. And he's like, we can kill him right now. I'll snap my fingers. I'm like, yeah. And I just went up there with a bottle and stabbed him multiple times. He bled out. And after that, I could. I heard like the other like Epsilon members programs. They were like doing some ritual. And they said that his spirit's going to heaven now. Oh, fuck. Yeah, fuck them guys, man. I, I've been having nightmares about them and shit. Oh uh, yeah, I mean, I heard stories a few times when, like, the cars, and he had to be tied up. Did, did, did it burn down your car or something? I... Yeah, yeah. I had to find, I had to re resurface my fucking van, man. Ah, oh, damn. Burnt down, burnt down my Cuda, burnt down my old Mustang. Uh, it burnt down the, the little uh, house that I was staying in, but that's okay. I ended up getting some more money, and plus... I found I, I found my card that had Mona's money on it, and I bought me a house. Oh, nice! So, what are you ever gonna do with Mona's trailer, man? Since you got the deed to it. Uh, I thought it was in your name, man. No, yeah, no, yeah. I I know she signed it over to me before. Yeah, know, I got I got maj I got majority of the money because I was made to her, but the house she she's giving to you, she told me to uh, apparently in the will it said uh, I can go f off, but the lawyer didn't want to say the f word. I mean, I could, I, I could still probably crash there because you know it's closer to the bar here, man. But I mean, yeah, I bought, I bought a little house over there out in Harmony. 
Then we might have to go check it out. I got some uh, vehicles to pick up because when I bought this bar, it came with uh, four vehicles. You probably Wait, saw that you van. The bar? Oh yeah, yeah. Paco did just call me and tell me you just bought the bar. Uh, how's Paco doing, man? I haven't seen him since he helped me escape. He's doing good. Speaking of, are you a legal citizen again, man? Yeah, but I'm fully legal again. I bought this bar, and it's called Mickey's Groovy Hangout. I made a web page and everything. It, it was hard to make that web page. I don't know how to use computers, man. Uh, yeah, man. I bet. You probably had to apply for your business license. Yeah, I, I, I bled for a business license. Yeah. Hell yeah. That's nice, man. But yeah, hopefully but you can make some money now. But yeah, we gotta. Go, I gotta go out to Harmony. Uh, we'll, I mean, we'll have to make multiple trips. But uh, where, where's your new house at? Yeah, it's right over there in Harmony. You know where the oh. new LS Customs is? Yeah, that's where I got to go pick up my uh, three uh, extra cars for that I bought with the bar. Oh shit! Hell yeah! No, yeah, it's it, like it, that little uh, liquor store or the convenience store right across the street. It's it's right behind there. Oh, I think shit. you got a customer, man. Oh shit! Hey, what's going on, man? These boots fit nice, too. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Did you change your clothes? Yeah, I put on my bar uniform I bought. You got oh. one, too. Everything is, uh... Everything's very old peachy, man. That's good. That's really good, man. Uh, hey, you want to go for a ride in the new van? And we'll, we'll go stop checking your new house out. And then, like, we'll go pick up the new cars for the bar. Yeah, yeah, sure. All right, let's go, man. Oh, oh my bad. Oh. <laughs> Let me respond, my bad. Oh, man. Damn it. Yeah, I have. I hate when it does that bullshit. On. All right, I got like a little GPS thing that the the guy at the repair shop installed in here. Just like put it on the GPS, man. Uh, for what? My house? Yeah, your house, or man. The, or the shop? No, I know where the shop's at, but I'm talking about your house, so we can find oh, out where your house right. is at, man. Yeah, it's 241 Harmony Lane. Hey, man. Sounds good. How you like this van? Oh, man, it rides nice. It's I pretty cool. I know. It's got, it's got that Chevy in it. It just looks like your oh, van. Yeah. yeah, I know. Just... Yeah, I'm just a little upset because they destroyed, like, a old-school Chevy, man. That's, yeah... Apparently, the, the old bartender that owned this car, apparently when he opened up that bar, he said, uh, uh, Pit My Ride actually, uh, uh, did this before, the, yeah, before the show got canceled. Apparently, this car was all ready and they took it and pimped it for him. Yeah, I know. I was like, no shit. He showed me the video and everything, but, oh shit, this is, a uh, this car is on TV, man. So, I, I'm driving a famous car. He just... He 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 kind of laughed at that. And said, "Yeah, that show wasn't famous. That's why it got like shut down." Yeah, but a lot of the like the electronics that was put in the back that doesn't work anymore. Apparently, after they're done recording the episode, they take it all out. I was like, "That's dumb." He's like, "I know. I thought I was gonna get to keep it, and then when we we're done recording." They literally said, all right, start taking it all out. And they sent, like, a group of guys in. And the guy told me that they just started, like, taking it all apart. And I know, man. I'm like, that's messed up. He's like, I know, because I was promised that stuff. I mean, this van should be fine. Yeah, man, it's right up here. It's uh, not this house to the left, but the, uh, this blue one with the red top right on it. Oh, this one right here? Yeah. Oh, you got a driveway, too. 
Yeah, I'm trying to reestablish that CUDA that's right there, too. Slip that off. Oh, yeah, you gotta brighten up the lights. Yeah, so this is the kitchen. Oh, yeah? Ba bathroom's right through there. Oh, shit, let me check it out. Oh, shit, it's dark in here. I can't see shit. Yeah, I know, man. That's why I wait for the dates. Well, what if you got a shit at night? Yeah, that shit happened. Uh, here's a little dining room. This is, the, uh, this is the, I guess, my living room. I mean, I would take, uh, no. I, I would take this wall right here where this door is for like this dining. I would just like tear it down, man. Make it an open concept. Yeah, I was thinking about the same thing. But yeah, dining room, living rooms. Oh shit! You here's got two bedroom. chairs. It's like a man cave right here. I didn't change nothing oh, from whoever lived here last. Oh, and look at this, man. I even got a pool table. Oh, no shit. Yeah, a oh. little bar room. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, fuck. Man. Yeah, man, our own little bar room. Big-ass fucking 65-inch screen TV. The only thing I don't like it. You, you, me you, you remember that TV that you, you took in that fucking old Dodge? Oh, yeah. Walmart? Oh, yeah, it's back in Indiana. It's that TV. No shit. No yep, shit. It's still got the tag <laughs> on the back if you look. <laughs> no, let me. It's even got the fucking scratch on the right hand oh, corner too, yep, man. Oh, yep, yep, yep. There's the tag. Yep. Nine ninety nine. So, well, you took out the wall from fucking. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Told Jose that no, nah, man. This it said it wasn't display. I put the money down. I paid for it. Yeah, I know. I, this is just. A yard. Oh, okay. That's yeah, cool. Only thing it's I. Prepared. Only thing I don't like though is why, why does your pool table have like I gotta pay quarters to play it? Oh, that don't work. Oh, you disabled it? Yeah, I disabled it. I was about to say, yeah, I, 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 I'm not gonna pay to play it. It's it's your nah, pool yeah, table. That's yeah, that's that's only if people I invite over there. I don't know paying for that shit. Yeah, but it's it's pretty dark in this kitchen, man. I would light it up. Man. Yeah, there's a, there's a beer in there if you want one. Grab one too. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I'll grab you one. Here you go, man. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, this ain't, this ain't yeah, a bad place. You got place. the bar and all and everything, and you got the apartment upstairs, but, I mean, here, here, here's a spare set of keys right here on the table. You're more than welcome to come by any time. Oh, shit, yeah. I mean, I, I might need a place to, you know, come hang time to time. Yep. Especially, it's going to get lonely with you not being my roommate upstairs anymore. Yeah. Who knows, man? Maybe I'll turn around and sell it, and then you take the fucking trailer. Yeah, I mean, Mona's trailer is still there. I mean, yes, I I paid a lot of money for this shit, man. Now I'm broke. I mean, I wonder if you could find any like renovators to like change the inside up and give a different interior MLO to it and just mm. have a better trailer. That that would be nice, man. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. that'd be nice. Or maybe try to find like another house in Sandy near the bar so you could be closer yeah. to me. Yeah, it wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, it wouldn't be. Oh, uh, yeah, after we uh, take care of all these cars and whatnot and get them back to the bar, I think we got to pick up three cars because we got the van. There was a total of four cars. Uh, but after that, guess what? What? You, you, you remember that bar in Indiana? Well, the lady left Indiana when it got shut down. She opened it up back here. The one by the highway? Yep, but I'm already banned from it. Oh, man. But, Damn it, Mickey. But I'm still... But I'm, I'm still going to go back, you know. Uh, yeah, hell yeah, man. We're going to have to definitely go back. As I told the cop the last time when she was trying to kick me out, I said, I'm paying my bar tab. It's right there. See, I put the money in, but she was still trying to tell me to get out. Hell yeah. Shit, man. I mean, if you don't feel like driving the, uh, the, the van, we could always, like, walk across the street and go get the cars if you said they were over there. Yeah, baby. We got to take the van back to the bar, man. Oh, yeah, that's true, that's true. And think that through. I'm yeah. still a little high off this coke. Yeah, so, I mean, it won't... Are you, are you, are you still doing any of the hard stuff anymore or no? I mean, I'm still doing it here and there, but I'm trying to, like, I'm trying to rewind back because uh, Miss, Mrs., uh, you you know that lady officer? Mrs. Reed? Yeah, she 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 was threatening to take my license away, and oh, shit. because she found all the hard drugs in my car, she was like, she was gonna Damn. she was gonna like screw my life up where I couldn't drive anymore. Oh shit! Yeah, but yeah, let's uh let's go, go pick up some cars. 
front of me. I just I just put it right here underneath the fucking washer. Dead. The number one rule, I told Ricky this, number one rule, when you're working at the bar, the bar stays clean. But what happens outside of the bar, stays outside the bar. Even for myself. I hear that, man. Business is first. Yeah, business is first. I don't want to get shut down. Especially, especially if you're just trying to become, you know, professional. I understand. Yep, yeah, I, I was told that I can get shut down in a heartbeat if we get caught. Right. All right yeah, let's go ahead and pick up these cars. Hey, man. Shit, I'll let you drive the van there, man. Let you get a feel of the bar van. She drives just like your van, but the steering's not like a little loose. You know how yours wobbles to the left a little? Yeah. And after the repairs, I can never fix that. Well, yeah, after the fucking deputy bites set her on fire at the junkyard. Fucking bites. So this place up here, right? Yep, right here. You could just uh, you could just park it in the garage, and then you can go inside. Uh, go talk to the guy behind the desk. Tell him it's Mickey Flowers, and uh, I'm gonna he uh, he's All gonna right. he, he, I'm gonna go in the back and get the car. I know where they're at. <clears throat> hey man, what's going on? Hey, what's going on, man? Uh, not much. My name's Dickie. Uh, I'm here with Mickey Flowers. He said he was picking up a car. Uh, yeah. One second. Uh, let me check here on the computer. Uh, let's see. Uh, it's M-I-K-I-E? Uh, M-I-C-K-Y. Oh, like, uh, Mickey Mouse? Yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, okay, uh, and last name's, uh, Flowers, right? Yep. Like your plants. All right. Uh, so, uh, what can I get you here for today? Uh, he's supposed to be picking up a car, I guess. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It says, uh, it says right here. I was just, I just had to confirm. Yeah, he's got three cars he's picking up. Uh, it seems like the first car we got ready for him is a wagon. Uh, yeah, yeah. Cause we already picked up the van. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The van he picked up earlier. That thing's yeah. nice. Uh, I put the underglow in there. He didn't, he didn't really care for it. Uh, what really? I like it. Yeah, he, he and he thought the rear end was a little weird because we we chopped up a Chevy classic. Rear end, man. Yeah, well, he was upset we chopped up a classic. I understand. People get upset. We like to do weird things here. I might have to bring my van here, man. Yeah, we could we could we could definitely uh, do that, especially if you're gonna be working with him at that bar that he just bought. You told me about. Oh, uh, yep, yep. Yeah, definitely. Well, uh, here's the keys to the wagon. It's gonna be in that paint shop. Uh, uh, I'm not sure where your friend's at, but yeah, just tell him it's in the paint shop. Alright, all right, man. Alright. Alright, thanks, bud. Alright, no problem. Alright, I'm just gonna let you walk out and change characters. Oh, shit. Where the fuck is he? I thought he was coming to talk to the guy. Hey, I'm looking for my uh, brother, Dicky uh, Dicky Cheese. Oh, he's out there in the paint shop? Oh, okay. Alright. I can't to, I can't wait to see what this new bar car looks like. Oh sh Oh shit. Oh there you go, Mickey. Oh yeah, I car? Yeah, I had to use the bathroom real quick. Oh you're good? Oh, yeah man, that bitch is nice. Oh shit. Yeah, the the, the guy I bought the bar from he said he had uh, three nice ve well four with that van uh, but three nice vehicles that he's got here that was owned by the bar. Apparently, he said we used these to pick... Well, he used them to pick up beer and shit. I believe it. Yeah, alright. Well, let's start driving the back. You want to drive the wagon? Sure. Alright, I'll let you drive it. I'll drive, I'll drive the... You. I'll drive the bus. And as soon as he asked for the drugs or whatnot... He was leaving, and as he was leaving, he literally was telling me, Hey, how about you take your character and like uh, act like you're walking outside or whatnot? I literally started walking outside. As I'm walking outside, like, as I'm walking outside, man, like, the motherfucker, he's like, uh, like, getting in his car. And kid you not, 
I could have swore I thought it was Ricky, but maybe it wasn't. But the motherfucker got in the car. It, it was a cop car. And I just sold him coke. After that, I kind of knew something was fishy, so I said, no, no, this, this is not happening. I went and hid. Guess where I hid? I hid in that, ga that garbage can that you hid that one time when the cops were looking for you. It took him a while to find me, but eventually I heard that. I mean, at first I didn't know who he was, but I heard a cop say, yep, it, I heard this dumpster move. And then he popped it open. I popped out. He arrested me. And then I, I, he was like, do you know who I am? I said, no. He's like, I'm the guy from the bar. I'm like, you don't look nothing like him. And he was like, I was like, hey, what's your name? He's like, well, the funny thing is I never told you my name, but my name is... Uh, Deputy K. Struts with the Blaine County Sheriff's Department. I was like, wait, wait a minute, what, what? He was like, K. Struts. I'm like, no, it can't be. He was like, wait a minute, Mickey? I'm like, no, no, all that bullshit in Indiana? No, no. I'm like, this is bullshit. So then the cuffs got, like, somehow loose where he was trying to cuff me, but he, he didn't, like, snip him in all the way. So, like, my hand got loose. I just started beating the crap out of him. I should have pulled his gun and killed him, but I knocked him out. Yeah. As soon as I knocked him out, I seen two bo cops walk out of the bar and I knew that's when I had to run. Yeah, I got I, I got caught. Eventually, I ran around the block a few times. I was threatening to jump in the water if they were going to tase me, but then I made it back to the bar and I was going to try to steal the cop car, but I got tased and the cop was yelling at me, like, yeah, get on the ground, motherfucker. Get on the ground. They were just hassling me, man. Yeah, oh, welcome back, man. Hey, what's going on, man? Hey, what's going on? Uh, you're you're here to pick up uh, the next car. Yep, car number two. All right, here's the keys. This one's gonna be like the old, like uh, you know, those lowrider type vehicles. Oh yeah, for real? Yeah, yeah. The but the bartender had like a v old vehicle like that, so that's the second vehicle. Here's the keys. Nice. All right. I know your buddy keeps using the bathroom a lot, but it's all good. Yeah, he's diabetic sometimes. Yeah. All right. Well, it, it'll be in the bay that we just washed it in to the left. All right. Thanks, man. All right. Have a good one. Yep. Do. Fucking hippie. Yo, yeah, what's what's going on, man? Where's he at? You already gave him the keys? Damn, yeah, I had to use the bathroom again. Alright. Fuck. Yeah. All that bear I've drunk today. Oh shit, I hear the horn honking. Oh shit. Nice, Does... ain't it? Oh, hold on, I gotta open does this have uh, hydraulics? I don't know, man. Let me it looks like it looks like it came from the Jetsons. Let's see. Vehicle doors. Let's open them all. Let's see, is there any pumps back here? Uh, nah, there's no pumps. Oh, damn. This thing's a classic, though. Hell yeah. Alright, so you can drive this one back. Alright. Meet you back at the bar. Yes, in it. Yeah. I'll pay you back on your next paycheck. Next paycheck? Yeah, you work here at the bar, man. Oh, for real? Yeah. I gave you clothes earlier to go upstairs and change when the cop came. Uh, uh, the door was locked, man. Ah, uh, damn. Ah, uh, yeah, I forgot. I got new locks because they destroyed the cops. Destroyed the whole entire upstairs when they're like trying to find me. Uh, yeah, I uh, I also broke in early uh, too. Yeah. With uh, some new guy named Rip. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I was told that by the cops. Yeah, I just wanted my old clothes back. Uh, I mean, understandable. I mean. As I told the cops when they had me in interrogation, I told them, I was like, nah. I was like, he, he's on the lease. I mean, he's not the one that, that's got majority share of the house, but I was like, he's on the lease. Right. And I'm like, he's allowed to go in any time, but the cops said, no. If we got your shit locked and you and you can't get in there because you got a, like a warrant out for your arrest for witness protection program, you're wanted worldwide. That, that was locked, and he, he, he broke the locks, and he stole stuff out of your house, and it could have been stuff that was for investigation purposes. I said, yeah, that's fucked up. I'm like, now you guys are just trying to trump them up with charges, man. 
just like this cop probably had that's still sitting here up this road up here trying to just catch someone. Yeah, it's got nice handling, man, and the engine sounds nice. It's got that old school style sound. Oh, what the fuck is that car doing? No clue. These locals don't know how to drive, man. Yep, what'd I tell you? That fucking pig's still there. Ah, back again, man. Man, your, your buddy, I just seen him. Yeah, hey, what's going on, man? I just saw your buddy ran back to the bathroom, man. Yeah, he's got he's got some problems, man. But, uh, yeah, we're here for that last car. All right, yeah, just let me get the keys. All right, okay, the total's going to be 5,000. Five grand, oh, shit. Oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, wait. No, 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 sorry, sorry. I was, I was looking at the wrong computer. I was looking on the one on the right. No, you're free. This is all free. Uh, it's already paid for. My, my uh, bad. Okay. Oh, okay. Alright, man. Thanks. Alright, have a good one. Fucking hippie. <laughs> hey, where the fuck did that worker go, man? Hey. Oh, shit, there's a door over here? Yo, Diggy, are you in here? Yo, what's going on? Where's that worker at? I just seen him walk off nonchalantly. Oh shit! What the fuck? Whoa! What? What's this? Oh shit! There you are. Yeah, yeah, I'm trying to find that fucking car, man. Yeah, I was trying to talk to the worker, and he just walked off and got in his car and left. Oh, oh what the fuck? Oh. Oh shit! This is like a car showroom. Yeah. Oh, this is nice though. It is nice. Let's see what's back here. It is a nice place. Hey, free beer. Oh shit! What? Oh shit! Oh. Office. Yeah, I seen the oh, guy. Hey, wait, wait, is that it out there? Oh yeah, that's it. Oh, it's outside. Yeah. It'd have been nice if he would have told us. No oh, shit, man. He just gave me the keys. That was it. I know, I got out of the bathroom, I tried saying hi to him, and he just walked to his car, and he got in and took off. I heard, I, I could have swore I heard him call us a fucking hippie. Yeah, he had a little toot to him, man. He kind of did. Leaving this one outside and get all rusty, motherfucker. Uh, man. Oh, shit, man, this one is all fucking rusty. Yeah. He said he was going to take this rust away. Ah, damn. Alright, well, hopefully... You got the keys, right? What the fuck is that thing? Is that an old air conditioner? Oh, yeah, that's the air conditioner. The bartender said this car's so old, it doesn't even got an AC in there. It's only got a heater. Damn. Yeah. That uh, sucks. That's going to suck because it's hot as fuck out here. I mean, yeah, but then again, my old van didn't have a AC, so... Yeah, but you're also just blowing extra hot air on the inside. Yeah, true, true. I mean, he told me to keep the windows down. Right. You got the keys to it, right? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna need them. Ah, oh, shut up. Yeah, yeah, see? But I think she's closed right now. I think there's a bar in Polito that we could try to steal some ideals from him. For sure. Damn, these guys don't know how to drive. Yeah. Apparently there's going to be this guy I mean I don't physically really know him Because I just got back But apparently he's a part of a motorcycle club out here And apparently when we do the grand opening on the first He's going to come and he's going to want to talk business Oh uh, yeah I'm not sure what it's about I mean I'm trying to stay away from the criminal aspect of things right now And trying to better my life Oh uh, yeah I hear you I hear you I, I mean it depends what the offer is 
Because I, I know the Lost offered us a lot of stuff and promised us many things, and they failed. Yeah, I heard the uh, Outlaws are moving out here. Or uh, Sons of Anarchy is moving out here, but the Outlaws not too happy about it. Oh, yeah? Yeah, something like that. That's not good. Yeah. Just like in this. That's the what we fucking need, man. Yeah, I know. It's just like in the city. At first, it was it was the grapes and the green beans, but then it became the bananas. And then now they just all fight. And now we're gonna have the county and motorcycle people out here fighting. Mm-hmm. I left the city to get away from that bullshit. That's what I'm talking about, man. Damn. Shit, it looks a little different out here. It's been a while since. It does. I mean, this ain't Wisconsin, but Scott Valley looks crazy, man. Yeah, it looks like they uh, added some trees. Yeah, I know. Oh, shit. Is there a building up here? I don't know. Maybe? It, it looks like there's a building up here. To the right? Yeah, my eyes ain't missed, Steven. Oh, shit. It is a building. It says the lost on it. Oh, no, no. I, I don't want nothing to do with them. They said they were going to keep me from getting caught by the cops. And what happened? I got caught by the cops. Yep. Ain't, ain't going to fall for their bullshit again. Hey, what's going on? Yeah, I'm just going to walk back here. Another bartender to another bartender. I'm allowed to do this. I'm just going to grab me a beer. Oh, man, you're already behind the bar. Yep, I, I told the bartender. Another bartender to another bartender. I'm just grabbing a beer. And I'm not paying for it. So, yeah, no disrespect, bartender, but we're going to go look around, and we're going to see what this building has to offer, because we're trying to better our bar so we can get more customers. So they got a workout area. They got a table here. Rejects. Yeah, they're a bunch of rejects, all right. Yeah. This bar is pretty dumpy, man. Pretty dumpy, man. Oh, hey, nice picture. Oh, nice picture. Well, oh. Damn. What are you looking at? The wall? Or the mirror? No, no, right there. There. Right there, man. Oh, yeah, nice picture. Yeah, that is nice. You just, I mean... I I mean you, you I wouldn't sit the other way opposite on the toilet, but I mean if I could hold the picture in my hands, I mean I could stand I guess, but yeah, he's lazy. And what I gotta pay for the beer? No, I'm a bartender. I don't gotta pay for it. I got a bartender license. Nah, 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 see? The beer is always free at my place. Why can't it be free here? That's bullshit. You don't know me. It doesn't matter if you don't know me. I don't fucking know you. And I would give you a free beer if you came to my bar because you're a bartender. Now, guess what? You're banned from my bar. Banned. No, no, you're banned. No, too late. You can't come back. You're banned. Oh, Dickie, this, this person's banned. Yep, you're banned. Oh, shit, yeah? Yep, banned. Oh, well, I guess they are banned. Yep, I would have gave them a free beer if they came to my bar and told me they own this bar and they're a bartender. But yeah, they're not going to give me a free beer. She says she doesn't care that I'm a fucking bartender. That's bullshit, man. What, what's that? You call me a fucking hippie? Oh, hell don't no. You, don't you fucking call the cops on us, either. You better not call the cops. What if you did? You better not have. Stereo. Okay. Eh, not too many people on, but there's cops on. Oh shit! I think I hear gunshots out there. Yeah, I do too. 
Oh shit. Let's go check out the back door. Oh shit. I don't know what the fuck's going on. I mean, I mean, you said there was like a motorcycle club, right? Yeah. Yeah, see, that's probably them causing chaos and Pam and Millennium, you know? Yep. Yeah, this bar has nothing to offer, man. Guess not. Let's see. Oh shit! What's on this table? Oh, oh wait, shit! Is that crushed, crushed up pills? Oh shit! I think there's crushed up pills on that magazine. I'm taking that. Oh shit! There is pills right there. But there's a couple of them next to the magazine. Drug menu. Um, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna hit a heroin. I'm gonna say it's heroin. Oh shit! That was heroin, man. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh. Oh, oh shit. Oh, I'm feeling good. Oh. <laughs> ooh. You all right? Yeah, I'm, I'm all right, man. I'm just feeling, ooh, the room is spinning. Oh, the room is spinning. You, there's like five of you. Whoa. When did I get five brothers? Whoa. This is trippy, man. Whoa. <laughs> but I'm gonna take some of this too. Oh shit! Oh, oh the room's getting darker. Whoa. Where am I, man? Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm tripping. My I'm eyes, tripping. man. Uh, I'm, I'm going to sleep again. Oh, oh fuck. Oh, shit. Ugh. What happened? Whoa. Whoa. I'm not taking whatever that was. I didn't like it. I didn't like fuck it either. Fuck this bar, man. Yeah, fuck this bar. I ain't paying. Bye. Later, bitch. Let's get out of here. Get back on a car before you get back in. Take take some drugs. What? Uh huh? Got any more back there? Yeah. Let's let's see. Let's get more. Let's burn this bitch down. I got a I, I got a gas can, man. I'm gonna pour gas all around on the inside. I'm just gonna go on the inside and fill this bitch up with gas. Start getting the floor all wet. Oh, There's a cop here. Oh, shit. I wish we could burn that little trellis out on fire. Oh shit, man. Oh, they snitch. Yeah, oh, yeah, they know. They know we set a fire. We're gonna have to run.
I know he's trying to open up his door. I, I, well, if we take off, that's going to be hard for him to get in. Hello? It's, it, it's going in. It's going in, man. So we, oh, uh, <clears throat> we received a uh, call regarding you gentlemen, you know, playing with some bottles, it seems, with fire in them. What's up with that? Uh, I don't know about no bottles with fire, but I had a couple beers earlier. Yeah, I had a couple you beers. The window for me real quick? There you go. Okay. So, uh, what are you gentlemen doing? And you know anything about that building on fire behind us? Nah. nah oh, man. Sh oh, that building's oh, on fire? Shit. It, oh, shit. It's on fire. Be a party to I didn't notice that. No, well, we're gonna have we're gonna have no choice. Structure fire at zero two yep. six. We're gonna have no choice. We're not getting away, but we're just gonna have to run. So, so you guys don't know anything about the building being on fire back there? Not at all, man. Not at all, man. Can I yeah. get your uh, driver's license, both of you, please? Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. I'm not yeah. driving. You ain't getting my information. Fuck off. Uh, you are currently gonna give me your information. Nope. You were under investigation. For nope. That is on fire behind you. I'm not under investigation. I wasn't in there. The easy way, or I can pull into the car and detain you. Uh, you better give him your your stuff, man. Nope, I was never in there. You were in the area, and you matched. That that's profiling. To, that's profiling. Uh, Mickey, is that you? What's going on, man? Fire. Mickey, come, come on, bud. That. I don't want to go to jail, man. Oh, I understand you don't want to go to jail. Man. No one said you're going to jail. We're just trying to get information from you so we can run it. Make well, sure you got no active warrant. If you know my name, you are in the area of a, an active uh, crime scene now. Well, so. if you know my name, then just go run it. You already know my name. Okay, I don't know the driver's name though, so I slid his ID. It's uh, if you want to go run him, it's Mickey Flowers. The driver's Mickey or the passenger's Mickey? The the passenger's Mickey Flowers. No, the driver's Mickey. I'm Dicky. Dicky? <laughs> sure. <laughs> Emma knows it's me. He's like, Mickey? Hey, you, you know that guy right there? Yeah, that's the guy that arrested me earlier, but apparently uh, I was with some, some guy named Reed and Mrs. Reed. Mrs. Reed said, weed's nasty, but she said LSD, coke, and meth is good to do. She messed up. Oh, shit. She messed up. And he, even her husband said, I think you just messed up. And she said, I misinterpreted her. I said, nope, nope, I didn't. I heard you correctly. Oh, damn. I don't like think that was, I don't think that was Mrs. Reed. I think that was, uh, uh, Trooper Creddy. Well, either way, I was told I could do it. I don't got any on me though. I mean, oh, but, probably but a not a good idea. An officer told you to go go do some though. Yeah, she said weed was bad and rather do that. Oh, well, shit, we gotta go do something. That's what I said. I was also told we can carry an ounce, but it's gotta be in our house. Who the fuck is that guy? Wait, did he just say he saw a gun? Which guy? Yeah, that guy right there by the dumpster. I have no idea. Both you gentlemen step under the car being detained at this time. What? No, we gotta go. Yeah, he snitched. Yeah, he snitched. Did that, that guy fucking snitch? I'm gonna kill him. Oh, fuck him. I'm gonna kill him. We gotta get out and ditch. I don't know where. Rowan, I am. I'm trying. Oh, we're running from the cops. You. S Do they see us? Yeah, this. <laughs> Fuck. 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 You know you can't hide. He said, you know you... 
He said, you know you can't hide. You got away? You got away, fuck! Motherfucker, get a car, come get me. I'm back on the main highway, hurry, they're coming. This ain't good. This ain't good. I'm, I'm get. I'm get. I'm get the god. Well, man, back away. Back away. Back away. No. Back away. They got me. They got me at gunpoint. Back away. Help, 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 I got a gun, they told me to put it down, let's pull the fuck off. Stop no. moving. Only if they let Stop you. Stop moving. Uh, uh. Stop moving. Ow. Stand up. Ow. It hurts. Where'd your buddy go? I don't know, he's somewhere around here I think, I just don't know where he went. They're looking for you. Let's see where, uh, where Dickie went. I, I lost him, man. I think he got away. Motherfucker, he's lucky. So before you say anything, you know, stupid. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you do or say. Okay, can we not do this over here? Can we just at least, at least go back to our cars? I mean, I guess. Yeah, you can just let me go. See? Yeah, let's not do this here. Just let me go. I've... Who's calling me, man? I, I think I think my phone's ringing. Yeah, the other one. Even the cops over here are saying who's calling us. Yeah, I saw what he was wearing in the van. I think he might be in the parking lot towards the right or something. I don't know. He got away though. Cause this is where we're at, and they might see him. He's gonna take him back to the station, question him. Oh, they're they're I'm not questioning him. Uh, I mean, we could let King question him, I guess. Yeah, I have no pre-context on anything that's happening. Yeah. All I know is this man ran from the police. You guys could just All let right. me go if you don't want to question me. Um, I'll let King question him. I'm gonna try to continue. Oh, they want. They want. Yeah, they want to interrogate me. Dicky Cheese. Hey, uh, I don't. I don't know where you're at. <laughs> And uh, if you want, you can try to question him. You told me you're like behind the bar, but I don't know exactly where you're at. So I, yeah. But even if I told them you're behind the bar, I don't know exactly where behind the bar. Okay. Honest to God, though, Ricky. My name's Mickey, man. It's not Ricky. Mickey. He called me Ricky. Enough. No, that's not close enough. Okay. Mickey, he said I close enough. Is. I'm like, no, can that's not close enough. Me this? Yeah. What's going on? What's the name of Dickie's mother? What's the name of your mother, Dickie? I have to ask her, uh... Very yeah, that's what the cop's asking me! Uh, I mean... Why do I gotta give up his mom? You gonna call his mom on him? Yeah, I'm gonna call his mom and find out why she decided to name him Dickie. Okay, yeah, it's, uh, Amanda Cheese. Oh. Yeah, give her a call and, the, you know, the little sky, she'll answer. Okay. Okay, he's gonna give a call to Skybox and he's calling your mom on you? <laughs> he's gonna ask her why did she have a kid named Dickie? <laughs> I, I, t I didn't tell him, I just, said, I just told him uh, your mom's name. <laughs> I wish I could put my seatbelt on, but out of RP, I'm not doing that because they didn't put it on me. But they're gonna they're gonna interrogate me. They wanna find out where you're at. I don't know where you're at. Oh shit, they got a new police station out here. 
Oh shit, they just updated the police station out here in Sandy. They see you? Oh shit. Oh, they got a garage here too? Well, you're about to witness all of this. <laughs> oh, they got a garage. Hey, you wrecked your car. Hey, officer. Hey, officer, you dropped your pocket. Me up. Nope. Nope. My lawyer's gonna have a field day on that one. Well, he won't, because I never asked you any questions. Yet. Right. But, see, it's it's not... Oh, there's our shooting range. I'll just let you know you're not gonna find him. I found him. You found him? Oh, they said they found you. He was doing... He was hard and we decided to throw uh, balls off of the same building. Nah, I think he's gonna get away. You ain't catching him. Pretty sure they already caught him. The cops over here, pretty sure we caught him already. Alright. Mickey, stay there. I'm gonna go help. Alright, okay, so Mr. Uh, Mr. Mickey, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you do or say will be against you to put a lie. The right to attorney, you can have a forward one, will be right away the state. Do you understand? Yeah, I understand, man. Okay, so you wanna tell me why you were throwing Molotovs at that boat? All right, I, I'll tell you the reason why. I mean, my my brother threw the Molotovs. I had I had I had the jury can, and I had the jury can. I poured it all over the bar, and he threw the Molotovs. The bartender was being really rude to us, and she wasn't making our drinks correctly. And I tried paying her for the beer, but she was trying to give me an outrageous price. And I know that beer doesn't cost that much, so I mean, my buddies start throwing it. I just joined in on the fun, man. So. I mean, that's a pretty shitty reason for doing what you did, but I mean, okay. Well, no, nah, not really, because I want to run that bar out of town, because I got a bar down in Sandy, and I'd rather have the only bar in town, so that way I don't got to deal with competition. He tried telling me it was shitty bar in the bar down. I was like, no, it ain't. What bar are you saying? Yeah, 296. I live on top. It's called Mickey's Groovy Hangout. I don't know you. Don't. Yep. I've owned it for a while. Be Greasy loves coming there and getting those greasy meatball sandwiches. The greasy meatball sandwiches? Yeah, we don't like making them because they're greasy and the meat gets everywhere, but they're only made for him. If he comes in, he can get them, but if someone else comes in, we deny it. It's only for him. He likes them for some reason. I don't know why. What kind of meat are you putting in those sandwiches? It's just regular meatball sandwiches. It's just we make them extra greasy, extra meaty. And Gre Greasy likes it like that. I'm trying to get this cop to say uh, Greasy likes meatballs. Well, actually, balls, because I told him that. So, he the reasoning behind doing that was because he wanted to You realize you wanted to run him out of town, but you do realize like, uh -oh. this isn't even the same town, right? It, do it doesn't matter. People like to travel out here, and, and they like to leave to my bar, come here, and go to these bars. So, if I get rid of them, this cop is pissed off for what me and you did. I know he's about to run me with the charges. He asked, why'd you do it? I said, well, my buddy started doing it. The bartender pissed us off and started spewing some bullshit. Here, right? Oh, damn, really? We got arson. I got arson. Destruction of property. Destruction of property. Got, uh, fleeing and eluding. Fleeing and eluding and trying to kill an officer. Huh? <laughs> did, did you say trying to kill an officer? Fleeing or eluding, which means run from the police. Okay, good, because I did have that gun, and if I could have shot him, I would. I'm going to pretend you didn't say that. Yeah, let's pretend you didn't say that. And uh, you're lucky it wasn't K. Struts. I'm still looking for him. When I find him, he's dead. What did K. Struts do? 
He, he, he came to my bar, and I knew that when he came to my bar, he was an old friend of mine named Ricky Jones, but he claimed he wasn't, but he looked exactly like Ricky Jones, then comes back looking completely, totally different, and then said that he was a cop under investigation. And I said, no, BS, and I went and hid in my dumpster behind. It took him a while to find me, but then they arrested me, but then the cuffs, they, well, they didn't, he didn't get them on tight enough, and I slipped. I started beating him up, and then when I was done, I should have reached for his gun and shoot him, but then two cops came out, so I ran. So he was, he did a sting operation on you. Yep, but he, he looked t totally, completely different when he came back. He said, remember me? I'm like, no, nah, your face doesn't look familiar. I work at a bar. I would remember faces. He was like, I was the guy that was there at a bar. I was like, no, you don't look nothing like him. It was a setup. A legal setup, in my opinion. I'm snitching on struts. I saw that because he said, what happened to you in struts? I was like, oh yeah, I beat that fucking cop up. And I said, I wish I would have pulled the gun out. But I was like, two cops came walking out the door. So I went and ran. So, so what happened is you're saying he, he was undercover? He, 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 so, he, so he came into my bar and he looked like some old hippie guy, kind of like me. And he got some beers, got some food. And then afterwards, he left. And then he got inside a car, and it looked like a police car. But then he came back, and he was looking for me, and I went to go hide because I saw the cops pull up. But then he said, remember me? And he looked like a young, like, adult. Like, he didn't even look like the guy that came in that tried to, like, snitch and try to find out what I was doing. Oh, so, like, he had, like, a mask on or something then? Or a no, no, he, he literally looked old as me. There ain't no mask. He had wrinkly arms, wrinkly legs. I mean, well, they have, our, our, you know, the department's got some better equipment, so they're actually able to make, like, fake wrinkles and stuff. Have you ever seen that movie? Uh, what the fuck's the name of that movie? He's uh, trying to uh, say that it was a costume where, uh, Struts you know, they, was wearing. They dress up. What's his nope. name? Oh, shit. No. They, they dress up like a back as a football basketball player as an old man. And nah, just like an old man nah, in the movie. That because he came in doing drugs before he even bought drugs off uh, me. He was doing drugs. Yeah, so you, that, yeah, I'd take that to court because as, a, as an undercover officer, you're still not allowed to do drugs. Exactly. And after he finished those drugs, he came and asked me for more drugs. And I kept on telling him, it depends what you're looking for. And he kept on trying to get me to say what it was. But I ain't dumb. I know cops do that to try to get you to say what it is. And then he said what he wanted. I sold it to him. And he came back like not even five minutes later with like six other officers. And all those officers. Officers, he was like, yeah, remember me? He looked like a 20-year-old. I'm like, no, that doesn't look legit. I'm like, no. I was like, this is BS, and I still got arrested for it. And I tried fighting it, too. Even my lawyer came. Yeah, that does seem pretty ridiculous. I mean, if he did drugs on duty, that's he should have got fired. But... Yep, he should be fired. Anyhow, Mickey, you're look so you're looking at arson, fleeing, arson, looting, flu and, looting. and destruction of property, destruction well, of property, damage of property. So that's going to be uh, 510 months, but <laughs> you'd all sentence you for 510 months, but I'll only jail you for not as much, you know, since the city's a little underpopulated. To catch my drift. Yeah, yeah, I understand. So I'm only going to jail you for. We'll just do a hundred. No, it sounds good to me, man. Okay, have fun in jail, Mr. Uh, Mr. Flowers. Alright, I will. I'm about to bail out of jail, so uh, you just tell me where you're at, and I'm going to come pick you up. Uh, uh, hello? Uh, Mickey! Uh, what's going on, man? Uh, where, where are you at? I just had to pay 5000 to bail out of jail, man. Oh, fuck. You got caught? Yeah, I got caught. And then they said you got away. I said, no, motherfucker, he got away and I got caught? What the fuck? Yeah, I'm sorry, man. But, like, when we... when I, I was following you and you ran around the corner of that, uh... The LS Customs, there was a bush, bro. And I, like, I hid in plain sight. They could have saw me, but they walked right past me, man. Ah, uh, damn, really? Yeah. And then I, I went back to the bar to burn the rest of it down. And someone caught me. And I ran out the back... And someone tried to chase me, and I hopped over the fence. He must have thought I kept going, but I ran back through the bar, and then uh, blew it up even more, and ran out the front, and then hid hid in the dumpster. But now I'm at the uh, I'm at the Outlaws bar that's right next to the gas station at Toledo. Oh yeah, I, I could yeah. Come, I could come pick you up, man. Oh yeah, please do, man. Yeah. It's hot out here. I got the wagon, so your body will fit good in the back. 
Alright, man, that sounds good to me. Alright, I'll be there soon. I just got out of jail, so I'm leaving the prison now, so it'll take me a few mics. Uh, Alright, man. Alright, see you soon, man. See you soon, man. Ah, oh, damn. Oh. You can get in the back, sit in the back seat. Go, go get on my side, yeah. Cause it looks a little darker. Let's see what it looks like. Nope. That's okay. You can sit in the back. All right, let's go, man. Hey, man. Yeah, I had to pay 5000 to bail me out, man. Fuck, man, I'm sorry. Yeah, I know. They caught me. I, I don't know. I thought we were, like, right next to each other, and all of a sudden, boom, you're we gone. Trip. So, like, right up here at the... Where these bushes are? Yeah, like, towards the right? Towards the right. I literally tripped, and then, like, I fell down, and they kept on going. Ah, damn. So I just, like, kind of stood there and crouched down, and they, they, they didn't know where the fuck I went, man. Ah, damn. Yeah. They walked right past me. They ran right past me. I seen you a couple of times. I'm like, ah, oh, baby. Yeah, I, I, I literally ran like uh, to the like the back, and I saw like a ladder, and got on top of this building. And the cops like, yeah, you got nowhere to run. And I was like, oh yeah. And I jumped off the building, and I got ahead of the cops. I thought I went inside that motorcycle club like workshop, and the cops didn't see me, but they did. So I ran in this room, Shit. and I found like a little nine millimeter in there, man. So I picked it up, and the cop came in. All I heard is, drop it, drop it. Oh shit, they updated the police station. Oh yeah, I just got arrested there, man. It was fucked up. Oh, okay, the cop went the other way. Yeah, but it, it's updated and everything. They got like a garage underneath where you could park cars, like down below. It's crazy. There's somebody on the lawnmower behind us. How's it going, man? I'm doing pretty good. You got, you got, you got any Mars bars in there or anything? You know? Nah, no Mars bars, man. Nah. Nah. Alright, yeah. sorry, my diabetes is uh, just acting up a little bit. I'm a blood sugar a little low. Ah, oh, damn. I'm sorry, man. Uh, That's fine. I wish I'll just I fish out, uh, I'll just fish out like a. Uh, I don't yeah. know, like a Snickers bar out of the trash or something. Yeah, just, Thank you. just go down to that 24-7 at the gas station. I'm pretty sure it's free. Oh, that guy that just parked just walking into. What's going on, man? What's going on, man? Not much. Just getting hassled by the cops. Yeah. Yeah, what's going on with you, man? You, uh, you need some green? Oh shit, yeah, my buddy's inside. We'll buy some. Let's go inside. It's a little quiet. I got some guy that wants to sell us weed. Where are you at? Hey, yo, I got someone that's gonna sell us weed. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he's right here. Uh, shit. I said, yeah, we'll yo. definitely buy. I just told him to come here. It might be a little quieter. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, for sure, man. Shit, I'll take a uh, half ounce. Stay here, I'll be back in five minutes. Alright, man, All right. no problem. Alright, sweet. You think we should do a 911 call? Because he's doing a drug deal now, and the clerk calls it in. No, boys. Oh, shit, yeah, just. I'll hook you up. I'll oh, hook shit. You up with the QP. Oh, nice, how much? Uh, just give me a hundred bucks. Alright. Here you go, man. Thank you, sir. Ah, Boys, thanks. have a good day. Yeah, you too, man. Hit me up. Yeah, yeah, you need you. some more. Yeah, shit. Yeah, no. What are we gonna do with all this? Hey, you got any? Uh, you got any harder stuff or not? What you need? You got any? I'm, I'm gonna go load this in the car.
Whoa, you blinded me there for a second. I shit my bad, man. Can't throw it this way. Whoa! Whoa! Wait, 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 what are you doing? Whoops. Huh? <laughs> no, I didn't. I was driving with one hand. Why were you going there? And that scar's got some bad steering, man. Where huh. are you going? Swap to the back seat. You almost hit Get me. Out of the fucking road. You, you almost hit me, man. What? You Mickey. Ran. I'm really sorry about that. I really am. This, this car's got some bad... I, I haven't drove this car, but today's my first time, and I was making that turn, and I had to hit the brakes. This thing didn't want to turn all the way. Mickey, who's your buddy here? My buddy? Oh, that's Ricky Jones. It's Ricky Jones, huh? Yeah. You got, heard, you got your ID on you, Ricky? I, I've heard Dickie's out running about. Yeah, Ricky's out. Yeah, I'm, looking, about I'm looking for that guy, too. He owes me money. All right, you both of you, you, me, both of you give me some IDs. You already know my name. You just said oh, my name. By, by the way, Mickey, uh, you're gonna have to get out. You're gonna have to get checked out by EMS since you did hit my vehicle. I, I'm hey, good. Way, I'm not checking out. out bad. Nah, you're I don't. Both gonna have to get checked out. There's an ammo at the intersection. We're right around the corner. Or that squad. I'm sorry. Yep. Whatever. I'll get out. Fuck it. I gotta get out too, man. Yeah, you gotta get checked just by like, EMS. Uh, yeah, you're, you're probably going to jail. Someone took the Legally priority. Legally required to have you checked since you 1050 and not You used to give him Frankie's ID. You ever take a drink today, Mickey? Nope. I wish I did. Got an ID on you. You got a drink for me? I mean, they gave him be water. Oh. Right. There you go. Give me, give me a couple seconds, all right? Go. Did you have nothing to drink? Nah. I mean, if you got some drinks for me, I'll take some. No, I don't have no drinks for you, Mickey. Do you, uh, do you mind? We're gonna have to do, uh, actually, we're gonna have to get a trooper down here for an accident report. An accident report? Come on, man. Just give me your insurance. I'll give you mine. We'll Romeo do... 40 to any available nah, trooper. Nah, nah, nah. No, you don't need to do that. No. One unseen. no, no, you don't need to do that. Uh, yeah, okay, I'm, I'm all seen as fire, but I can... Oh, you okay. Well, uh, just there's an accident, so I'm pretty sure you're the department that reports it. No, no, no. He said I can go. I'm free to go. Yeah, go no, you have to get checked out by medical staff, and they also have to fill out an accident um, report. Nah, I'm good. I don't need the medical. I refuse. Uh, unfortunately, no, nope. they're, they're, no, they're, not, they're not checking. Okay, I mean, you can refuse, but you still got to get an accident report. Right, I'll, I'll give you the accident report. They're not, they're not touching me. Negative, I believe. Yeah, Mickey's also refusing medical care. Yep, no, nope, they're not touching me. I mean, I hate to pardon, but that uh, ain't that his right? Yeah, he can refuse it, but he's still got to do this whole accident report so he hit a police officer. Yeah, I, I'll do that. As I told you, that was my bad. I didn't mean to do that, so I'll do that. Okay, you got your ID, your insurance, and all that information? Yeah, hey, let me go to the car and grab it real quick. Uh, so do you actually fill out the accident report on the cat, or do I do that since you're... Do you do it since you're a trooper, or what? There you go. Okay, thank you just one second, Mr. Mickey. I don't know. They took it right when I was about to run. I didn't want to step out. So, I can't... My CAD's not... Uh -huh. Oh. We might have to get back in. won't even let me put a time in the accident report. What the fuck? Because I never hit you. That's... Okay, whatever. Ah, uh, damn. I see it. On my screen, it said zero. Yeah. Is anybody else's CAD working? I don't know. I don't. Mm -hmm. I don't use it in the game. Mine's uh, mine's like I'm not just letting me do anything. Looking at Sonoran CAD. Hey, mine's working just fine. What do you need me to do? Can you uh, run just, a name just for the, me? Yeah, yeah. The the name. Sweet. Uh, fucking Ricky. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Ricky. What was the last name? Jones. Ricky Jones. Are you are, are you are you gonna said you was Jones Flowers? Cause Jones Flowers kind of looks like you. I forgot about that. I made Mickey's cousin. Dude, hit that motherfucking fire truck. You want me to hit it? No, not you. I was, oh, I was about to say you got to pay me money to hit that. I'll go to jail.
I ain't trying to go. I just had to pay five thousand to get out well, the last time. I'm just gonna give you a sheet of paper since the accident report is not actually fucking working for whatever reason. So what? here, I'm gonna need the sign here on the top sheet. It's gonna bleed through. It states that you were involved in an accident with me, and we had a chat as well as the fact that you. Give me a second. Ha ha ha! When the guy when the guy gets back and hands me the paperwork, you're you're gonna love what this GME I got. I'm gonna sign it all right, but then I'm doing something else after signing the paperwork. <laughs> Sorry about that, we had a little incident. So you're just gonna go ahead and sign on this sheet. It states that you understand that you were involved in an accident with a police officer, as well as the fact that you refused medical care, and you also presented me with your insurance and ID. Yep, here you go. Here's your pink slip. What you're going to do is you're going to present this to your insurance company and they will get it all sorted out through them, okay? Yep. Okay, that's... <laughs> that's fine. One will be sent to your address anyways. So, whatever you want to do. But, uh, I don't believe <laughs> he's done with your passenger yet. I will find out if you're free to leave. Just wait. Give me a minute. Yeah, we can't walk away, sadly. Damn, I, I even ripped it up and I'm still getting the ticket. Nice. Fucking bullshit, man. I think they're gonna buy along this whole fucking Ricky Jones bullshit. You kinda look like him. I, I mean, maybe. To be honest with you, you look more like my cousin. Uh... I mean, you gentlemen are good to go. You have a nice day. Oh, right. okay. That's a close Come one. On, yeah, let's go, Dickie. Come on, Dickie, let's get out of here for the cops to know that they're looking for you. Hey, we've been tr hey, we've been trying to get pulled over. <laughs> we've been trying. Uh oh. Beautiful window. You should do it in me. Here's like a thump in the back or something. How's it going, you two? The two. There's only one of us in here. I can very clearly see into your back seat, sir. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, I'm uh, I need some ID from you. Oh, what did I do, man? I oh, you ran that red light, uh, that stop sign right there. No, nah, there's no and red light there. No, you said red light. There's no, sign. you said red light, and I'm going by your word. I just saw you put. Okay. So uh, there's no red so light there, so I you can't you give me a ticket. Running a stop sign, and then you've been following me for quite some time. Oh no, not this cop. She's gonna take my license away. All right, license. Yeah, all right. Hey, Grady. Um, there's a homeboy in the back seat. He just, I watched him put a blanket over his head. He's going to sleep. Leave him alone. You're going to wake him up. That's my kid. His name's Mickey Flowers. Uh, what's your quote unquote kid's name? Nope. I'm not giving that information out. You a child molester? Nope. Just trying to identify nope. everyone in the vehicle. Nope. Uh, he's a kid. Nope. Sorry. How old is he? He he's twelve years old. <laughs> what, your twelve year old have tattoos? They're fake. They're from the quarter All right. machine. Alright. So <laughs> Yep. Come here. Yeah, they know that's you. What's going on? They know that's you. Oh, and the and the shitty thing is we're in the What's fucking the van ready? again. Oh, we're not getting away. He said red light. The cop's lying. Allegedly. Nope. Yep. Yep, when they come back up, I'm leaving. <laughs> he said he knows that's Dickie back there. 
Gentlemen, I'm gonna need you both to step out of the vehicle for me and join me on the sidewalk over here. You want me to join you on the sidewalk? Yeah, both of you step I out of the car and then come over to the maybe. sidewalk. If you want me to leave? I'll make this difficult. Take the keys out of the ignition, set them on the dash, and step out okay, of the vehicle right I'll, now. Okay, I'm taking the shifter and put it in the drive. No, do no. not put the fucking shifter in the it's drive. It's in drive. Step out of the car. Step out of the he put it in. It's yep. in drive. Okay. I don't know where we're gonna go. I'm gonna try to get you out of here, man. <laughs> hey, uh, well, yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> no, I know where I'm going. I no, I know where I'm going. No, I know where I'm going. <laughs> I I got a good idea where we should run. We're gonna go all the way down to the level and down that one road where it ends and the bridge is broken. We're gonna get out and run towards the beach. We're just gonna run. Hey, I'm not I'm not being too re I'm not being too aggressive. We're fine. We're good. We're good. She's trying to put. We're going out here. Because we're gonna run. Oh fuck. Where are you going? We're getting. There's nowhere to go from here, man. I know, we're gonna get out at the bridge and we're gonna run. Take my seatbelt off. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Stop running. Leave me alone, man. Ah, <laughs> stop running, Vicky. <laughs> I hear them behind me. Help! They get you. <laughs> They're right behind me. Help! 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 Give, give me out of here, man! Are you in this truck? I'm in someone's truck! Give me out of here! I got you, man. I got you. I don't know. We're gone. Oh, we can't, we can't. Hey, what's your name, man? My name's Mickey, man. Oh, this is nice. I, I appreciate the pickup. You're welcome, man. I gotta save you, you know. I can't go back. I'm hey, telling him he out. said no. Don't get out. Don't you even worry. All right, I appreciate it, man. They were trying to trim me up with a charge. That wasn't even legit. I think we got away. All right, Mickey. It's nice knowing you, man. All right, nice knowing you. Have a good one, man. I appreciate it. You're welcome.
out of RP. I got Jimmy's car. I got a haircut. I got new clothes. I'm out of here. If I make it out, the video's over. No, I never snitched. Okay, that's weird. AI just got out of the car at this traffic stop. Going around it. Yeah, but I repeat that I bought Jimmy's car. I got a haircut and I bought Jimmy's clothes. So I got, got a cowboy hat on when I get out of the car and I got shorter hair so the cowboy hat works. And I'm wearing, I'm wearing like a cowboy outfit type get up. I'm gonna go to Hopo Village and that's where I'm gonna end it for my side. As I said when I was running and you were muted, I said tit for tat. He got away the fucking first time, I got away this time. <laughs> Afternoon. Yeah. Yeah. My my textures are fucked up in Pleto for some reason today. Oh no, they were, they were, they were, yeah, but when I was running, yeah, when I was running, they were chasing me, and they basically went up to, like, the mountain where I was trying to climb up all these rocks and shit, they were trying to hit me with their car, but, I mean, it was kind of unlegit, and I heard one cop say, no, you can't do that, you would fuck up your car or whatnot, so then I got up on top of the fucking hill and whatnot. And here comes a guy riding a black truck, which I thought it was Dicky. That was the only reason why I hopped in. If it, if it wasn't, if I didn't know it was him, I probably never would have hopped in. But he hopped in. He was like, what's going on? You need to get out of here? I said, yeah, the pigs are getting me. And he said, what's your name? I said, Mickey. And he's like, nice to meet you. And I got away. But as I told Dicky, I said tit for tat because the first chase, he got away, and I didn't. This chase, I got away, he didn't. Yeah, that's why they, when they arrested me earlier, he said, I'm only going to put you in for a little one month. He was like, because, yeah, the cat's not working. Oh, shit. You got a nice little place I could stay here at the fucking where I'm hiding. Oh shit. I can make drugs here too. Alright. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Mickey Sticky Flowers gets away. Probably gonna have a warrant out for my arrest now, but it is what it is. So Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. Mickey Sticky Flowers. I'm I'm hiding now. I am pretty sure I got a bowl off for my arrest. But yeah. I made it away this time. Dickie made it away last time, so tit for tat, I guess. Other than that, thanks for watching. See you guys next time.
And come fly with me, my little fireflies, here at Firefly Gaming. Until next time, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Welcome to Mickey's Sticky Flowers Bar, now known as Mickey's Groovy Hangout. Indulge in a one-of-a-kind dining and drinking experience at our bar, where the atmosphere is always buzzing with excitement. Whether you're looking to unwind after a long day or celebrate with friends, Mickey's Groovy Hangout is the place to be. Now, let's dive into our extensive menu and discover the delightful offerings we have in store for you. Drink Menu Beers Mickey's Misty Malt minus $3 Sticky Pilsner minus $4 Bull Shark Testosterone Stout minus $5. Blaine County Blonde Ale minus $4. Pisswasser Lager minus $3. Mickey's Magical Beer minus $6. Los Santos IPA minus $5. Hard Liquor. Mickey's Magical Moonshine minus $5. Blaine County Bourbon minus $6. Los Santos Whiskey minus $7. Mickey's Mega Martini minus $8. Sticky Vodka minus $6. Mickey's Magical Meltdown minus $7. Bull Shark Tequila minus $5. Shots. Tequila Shot minus $4. Whiskey Shot minus $5. Vodka Shot minus $4. Rum Shot minus $4. Gin Shot minus $4. Alien Egg Bomb minus $6. Mickey's Magical Bomb minus $5. Now that we've explored our drink options, let's move on to the tantalizing selection of appetizers. Appetizers. Magic Mushroom Medley minus $5. Loaded Nachos Grande minus $8. Cheesy Garlic Bread minus $6. Spicy Buffalo Wings minus $8. Mickey's Marvelous Mozzarella Sticks minus $6. Mickey's Dazzling Jalapeno Poppers minus $7. After indulging in our appetizers, it's time to savor the flavors of our main courses. Main courses. Sticky Barbecue Pulled Pork Sandwich minus $12. Cheesy Bacon Deluxe Burger minus $10. Spicy Chicken Tacos minus $9. Margarita Pizza minus $10. Barbecue Chicken Pizza minus $12. Mickey's Mega Meatball Sub minus $11. Mickey's Dynamite Barbecue Ribs minus $15. Save room for dessert and treat yourself to the perfect ending of a great meal. Desserts. Chocolate Lava Cake minus $7. Classic New York Cheesecake minus $6. Strawberry Shortcake minus $6. Mickey's Dreamy Donut Sunday minus $8. Mickey's Magical Milkshake minus $7. But the fun doesn't stop there. Join us on Fridays and Saturdays for game night, where you and your friends can gather around the tables, play a variety of board games, and showcase your skills in darts. On Sundays, come for karaoke night, where you can showcase your singing talents and enjoy a night of entertainment. With a jam-packed crowd and an energetic atmosphere, Mickey's Groovy Hangout is the place to be for unforgettable nights of fun and laughter. Now, let's talk about the updated discounts we offer. Please note that prices are included for your convenience. Limited time offers. Mickey's Specials. 1. Mickey's Magical Mojito minus $7. 2. Mickey's Marvelous Mac and Cheese Bites minus $6. 3. Mickey's Tangy Teriyaki Chicken Wings minus $8. 4. Mickey's Coconut Cream Pie minus $9. 5. Mickey's Sparkling Strawberry Lemonade minus $5. Dicka's Delights. 1. Dicka's Dazzling Daiquiri minus $7. 2. Dicka's Loaded Potato Skins minus $6. 3. Dicka's Spicy Buffalo Chicken Dip minus $8. 4. Dicka's Chocolate Chip Cookie Sundae minus $9. 5. Dicka's Creamy Caramel Latte minus $5. Ricky's Specialties. 1. Ricky's Radiant Rum Punch minus $7. 2. Ricky's Zesty Garlic Parmesan Fries minus $6. 3. Ricky's Fiery Habanero Chicken Tenders minus $8. 4. Ricky's Raspberry White Chocolate Cheesecake minus $9. 5. Ricky's Refreshing Watermelon Margarita minus $5. Holiday Limited Time Offers. 1. Santa's Spiced Eggnog Martini minus $10. 2. Rudolph's Reindeer Burger minus $12. 3. Dicka's Cheesy Reindeer Dip minus $8. 4. Mickey's Festive Christmas Tree Pizza minus $11. 5. 
Ricky's Peppermint Mocha Martini minus $10. Additional limited time offers. 1. Big Greasy Meatball Sandwich minus $10 for the sandwich, $15 for the meal, available only when B. Greasy comes in. 2. Dicka's Delightful Clam Chowder minus $8. 3. Rudolph's Reindeer Chow minus $8, limited time until Christmas only. 4. Santa's Ho 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 Shot minus $5, limited time until Christmas only. 5. Ricky's Radical Rum minus $7, limited time only, goes away in a week. 6. Dicka's Spicy Chicken Tortilla Soup minus $7. 7. Mickey's Festive Turkey Sandwich minus $10. 8. Ricky's Jolly Gingerbread Cheesecake minus $9. 9. Dicka's Cheesy Jalapeno Popper Sliders minus $11. 10. Ricky's Tangy Orange Glazed Salmon minus $14. 11. Mickey's Magical Unicorn Ice Cream minus $8. 12. Dicka's Caramel Apple Crumble Pie minus $9. 13. Ricky's Pumpkin Spice Latte minus $5. 14. Dicka's Caramel Apple Drink Spiked minus $10. 15. Mickey's Mocha Drink Spiked minus $10. 16. Ricky's Tangy Orange Dream Drink Spiked minus $10. 17. C's aka the Hippie Chicken Sub minus $8 6 inch, $16 foot long. Please note that the limited time offers can be selected daily by you or your team, depending on who is working at the bar. The chosen limited time offer will be available for that day, alongside the holiday limited time offers during the respective holiday season. We hope this clarifies the process for choosing the limited time offers at Mickey's Groovy Hangout. Enjoy experimenting with these exciting flavors and providing a unique experience for your customers at Scott Valley Roleplay. Note, at Mickey's Groovy Hangout, we proudly support and honor our military veterans. Any individual who served in the military is eligible for a 5% discount on any day. Additionally, we extend our gratitude to the dedicated members of Law Enforcement Officers LEO, Emergency Medical Support EMS, and Fire Departments. While it is at the bartender's discretion, determined at the cash register, whether to provide the 5% discount, we understand the vital role these professionals play in our community and aim to show appreciation for their service. We also value the hard work of the Department of Transportation DOT. If you tow an illegally parked vehicle from our parking lot, you will receive a 5% discount. Furthermore, senior citizens can enjoy a 5% discount around dinner time. Join us at Mickey's Groovy Hangout and experience a welcoming environment where we value and appreciate those who have served our country, our local heroes, and our senior citizens. Come on down to Mickey's Groovy Hangout and immerse yourself in the lively atmosphere, delicious food, and fantastic drinks we have to offer. However, please be aware that Mickey and Dickie may choose not to provide the discount to individuals they have had negative experiences with in the past.